So um, apart from the obturator sign, um, the SOA sign, there's yet another sign that could be seen in um, acute appendicitis. And that is what the rove sinks signs. All right. And this is the sign that we'll be discussing this morning. All right. The rove sink sign that could be seen in acute appendicitis. So the rove sink sign is simply like, okay, you have pain on the right. Okay. But I won't palpate the right. I would rather palpate the left. But when I palpate the left, you still uh, feel a referred pain on the right. Do you understand? That's a rove sink sign that will be seen in patients that have what acute appendicitis. All right. So we're discussing this sign and everything that you guys really need to know about this sign. So we said that the rove sink sign is actually a clinical sign that may be present in acute appendicitis. All right. It is defined as what a pain in the right lower quadrant of the abdomen. That's where the appendix is located. Okay, and this pain is what exacerbated by palpation of the left lower quadrant of the abdomen. So look at it. You have pain on the right lower quadrant, but I won't palpate this right lower quadrant. I rather palpate what the left lower quadrant, and but you still feel pain here. Do you understand? That's just what the roof sink sign is. Okay. So now to elicit the roof sink sign. The healthcare provider will typically what ask the patient to lie on their back, all right. Then the healthcare provide uh, healthcare provider will now palpate or press the left lower quadrant of the abdomen. Okay. Now, as you are pressing it, don't just look at the abdomen. You observe the patient because some patients they can resist pain so much. So you might be pressing. If you are not looking at them, you not see any facial expression. But if there's some discomfort, some people will like, do you understand? At least, even if they did not shout, the facial expressions will be changed there, okay? So, uh, you observe the patient with facial expression and ask if they feel pain in the right lower quadrant, okay? Now, a positive roasting sign is indicated by what? Increased pain in the right lower quadrant with palpation of the left lower quadrant of the abdomen. Then there will be muscle guarding, all right? That's muscle tension. Or rebound tenderness in the right lower quadrant. Okay, now Rofsi sign is thought to be due to anatomical connection between what the appendix and the surrounding peritoneum. Now, when the appendix is inflamed, it irritates the surrounding peritoneum, leading to referred pain in the left lower quadrant. Okay, because the peritoneum is now all inflamed, even if you pop it the left side, they'll feel pain. Right side, you still feel pain. Okay, so now, while roofing sign can be useful adjunct in diagnosis, it is important to know that is uh, that is what is not always present in acute appendicitis, but most of the times it is present. Okay, you know in medicine we don't really like to say never say never. Okay, so anything can happen. All right, it can also be present in other conditions such as what diverticulitis or ovarian torsion. All right, it should be considered in conjunction with other clinical findings, laboratory results, and imaging studies to make an accurate diagnosis of what acute appendicitis. Okay, so this is a man that actually brought up this sign for us that's a nails tuckled rough sign. Okay, so just to review, uh, it is a sign when you palpate on the left lower quadrant of the abdomen, but there's now a pain. On the right lower quadrant of the abdomen okay now which is actually an indication of a positive result as observed in patients with what appendicitis okay so that's this is a man that actually brought up this sign for us all right so uh we just hope he's resting in heaven okay so this is a rough sink sign that will be seen in acute appendicitis see you guys pretty soon